I think women's programs are incredibly important. An incredible transformative space where you can sit with like-minded women who want to change the world, who want to see uh, the mind shift in, in everyone around them. To come together, to share our experiences, to share our um, fears, and to create that network of support, I think, that can help to push all of us forward. And with the women's programs, introduce is the idea that you can and, and they give the skills to do that and they start to level the playing field and I think it's important for our membership to understand that those programs are there. Women's programs can help women who might not see themselves in, in a union role to take the skills that they have within their community, the skills they have within their classrooms, and then learn that those are transferable skills and that can be used for social justice, for activism, and for, for leadership within our union as well. It's our response to institutional sexism, racism, homophobia, classism, ableism, other forms of oppression that we continue to see. It's our hard allocation of resources to make sure we are actually putting the structures in place that really make a key difference in our organization. I had never been in a room with 21 Indigenous female teachers before, ever. A lot of racialized women have a lot going on. We need champions to, to, to support us. And I think there's a genius with women mentoring women. It's about, this is us, this is our future, and we gotta make sure it's set up right for the teachers that come after us. You know, it's not enough just to have a commitment on paper and to have goodwill and to have really good intentions in this direction. What we actually know works is the hard allocation of resources. We need to make sure that that is funded and it's provided for them to have the training and the supports they need to be able to get up there and speak. And it only makes sense to take advantage of as many of these programs as we can and allow a space for women to say, why not me and why not now? It makes you realize you're not alone. You are relevant, your voice is relevant, your struggles are relevant and you're needed, your voice matters.